What's up guys? I am here at a new to me stretch of river, kind of getting into some higher mountain territory, maybe around 9,000 feet elevation or so. My friend has been up here before um, and he told me he caught a bunch of really nice sized browns um, on dry flies, no less. That's the goal, uh, nice sized fish, pretty small river, um, beautiful day. <laughs> Let's get in there, see what we can make happen. <laughs> wow, that's a little guy. Come here, bud. Come here, buddy. There's a little tiny brown for you. Must be the young of the year. <clears throat> Hopefully their parents are out hunting as well. That might be a theme for today. <laughs> to be determined, of course. Oh boy. <laughs> Another little one. <laughs> It's all right, we're gonna find the hole where the parents live. It's gonna happen. There we go. All right, all right. Not a big brown by any means, but uh, a bit bigger. So we're heading in the right direction. <laughs> So that's cool. There we go. About a oh five inch or so. <laughs> Excellent. <laughs> Thanks, dude. So I think I might give this stretch of the river. I don't know. We'll see. I'll play it by ear, but I'm thinking at some point I might need to head on down to kind of where some of those other creeks flow into it. Um, maybe there's gonna be more water there and subsequently bigger fish. So uh, I feel like I have to give that a try. Um, but you know, I got the, I got the fisherman's curse, so I gotta at least go up a, a, few, a few more pools, you know? <laughs> I can't just, can't just stop now. I can't be, I can't make that much sense, you know? It's just not okay. Oh man. <laughs> oh wow. There we go. <laughs> yep, there he goes. <laughs> Don't he was about three three, four inches, just to you know keep you guys updated. Sorry I didn't get a better shot of him. <laughs> oh my god, these little fish are gonna drive me insane. <laughs> I'll tell you what, I'm going to fish this pocket water here for a little ways. If I don't have any luck with a slightly bigger fish, we'll say, we'll say nine inches. If I can't catch a nine inch fish, then we're going to move up, um, or down rather, to the confluence of those other creeks in this river where it gets a bit bigger and uh, see if that doesn't help us out a bit. There we go. Not nine inches though. <laughs> A more aggressive take though, which was uh, nice to see. This guy fights, uh, fights above his weight class, you could say. <laughs> what a beautiful little fish. Check out those red spots. Gorgeous. Thanks, dude. <laughs> awesome. All right. Well, that's that. Let's head. Uh, let's head to some bigger water. See if we find some more fish and maybe bigger fish.
Man, the fish are not coming easy today. <laughs> Although, there we go. <laughs> go nice another little dude though you know what I'm actually gonna make a change here and uh, switch up switch away from dries uh, maybe that's the problem maybe uh, you know just the little guys are into the dries but uh, the big guys are not today so we'll switch it up get something else on but uh, Hey, that's a pretty brown. Look at those big red spots. That's sweet. Thanks for playing, buddy. All right, so I tied on a uh, Futsu Kabari, which is basically a stiff hackled Japanese wet fly. There we go. Yes. It's been kind of tough fishing today. Come here, little dude. Nice. Well, hey, even if they're little, they are beautiful. And the fish is a fish. I'm just happy to be catching fish in this beautiful place. Stunning here. Well, I wasn't really having a ton of luck with the uh, Kabari. Um, so, <laughs> I'm going to revert back to what I know and uh, throw a little jigged streamer on. Olive with a pink bead. And I don't know. I'm just not doing too well today. Maybe the river's not fishing well. Maybe it's something I'm doing. Um, but we're going to keep trying new stuff. Jig streamer usually pulls through for me, so let's see if we can make some more fish get in my net. Oh, oh man. struggling all right well the jig streamer is gone what else can I throw I think it's time for for some euro nymphs got a single rainbow warrior on Oh, yes, yes. <laughs> a fish. <laughs> oh, you guys don't understand the struggle. It's a nice one. Please get in my net. Oh, yes. Finally, I have been, man. Oh, come here, dude. Come on. Come on, come on. Ah. <laughs> Woo. Just dink after dink, short striking, no one connecting. Finally, I caught a decent brown and he ate it and he kept it in his mouth. <laughs> and I set the hook. Ah. Finally, what a stunning, beautiful brown, shaped like a football. Ah, oh, that feels good. I'll get him back in. Awesome. <laughs> that feels good. That feels good. 
Yes. There we go. Yes. Nice one. Nice brown. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. <laughs> Yes, so cool. <laughs> that was awesome. Saw my line uh, jump and take back off underneath that rock. And sure enough, this dude had bitten down on my rainbow warrior. Oh, cool. Thank you, buddy. There we go, there we go. Right up at the head of the pool. Deep in the current. Pretty nice fish here. <laughs> yes. Well, the day's turning around a little bit here. <laughs> Here we go. Not the longest fish ever, but uh, definitely pretty football shaped. <laughs> cool. All right, dude. Thank you. Awesome. All right, guys. Well, a uh, bit of a mixed bag today. Um, I caught quite a few fish actually, but for some reason it just felt like a real struggle all day. I'm sure you guys can relate. Uh, I'm sure everyone has days like that. It was just like every other cast, hung up in a tree, uh, snagged on a log underwater. Um, all the fish, especially the small ones in the beginning that uh, kept coming for my fly, uh, but not making a connection. Um, pretty much cycled through dry flies uh, to jig streamers. I used some traditional tankara flies. Uh, finally settled on just some uh, your nymphing stuff, um, a jigged rainbow warrior in the end is uh, kind of what ended up being the most productive, um, as your nymphing uh, often is, right? <laughs> it's just a great way to uh, catch fish. Uh, but, anyways, ended up catching quite a few fish in the end. Um, so, all in all, uh, not a bad day out here. It was certainly beautiful. Didn't see any other people, and uh, that is just the way I like it. With that said, uh, thanks for watching my video guys. I really appreciate you guys watching until the end and I will catch you next time.